watch the sound system tonight. Microphone on the speaker. <laughs> Somebody didn't have an aux cable. Yes, I was hungover this morning. Uh, we played at a brewery last night, Tiffin Brewery in Tiffin, Ohio. Started drinking 7% beers and I didn't eat dinner. I didn't even realize it because I was like running around, like trying to get the merch set up and uh, count that all in. Not being on tour for, for as long as I have, it's been over a year since I've been on tour. I just forgot everything. It's like, I have all this merch that I brought with me to sell at the shows. We get there like an hour before doors. I forgot that I gotta count all the stuff in and get my square register set up and all that. <laughs> so people are like filing in, like wanting to talk to me and stuff. I'm still trying to count, you know? Once I got that all set, like I got a beer. I wanted to try one of the beers. Juicy Deuce is what I got. Um, and it was 7% and I just, it totally slipped my mind to, to get dinner, totally forgot. And I don't like to eat dinner before, even two or three hours before the show. I just don't like it, I don't like that. It's, it's hard to play and sing, sometimes I'm like burping and shit. So by the time I go on, I'm pretty lit after one beer. Then I have like two more beers, you know, after my set. Brandon calls me on stage to sing a couple songs with him. I'm just like, what's up? <laughs> we had a lot of fun last night. It was cool to be out and play, play some songs for people. Um, everybody seems to be ready to rage for these things, just as I suspected. I gotta tell you that being vaccinated eases the, um, the weirdness about being out in public again and sort of uh, talking to people um, in a public setting. Just a lot less worry. And Brandon's vaccinated as well, so it's like, just feels more safe and just, you know, better. So we got up this morning, I had a headache. Jumped in the van, hit a truck stop, got some coffee. Then we drove to Pittsburgh. We are here at Jurgles tonight. The place looks really cool and the, the green room's dope. They've been taking care of us. We did like 200 pre-sale tickets tonight, so that's pretty awesome. Going on in about just a little over an hour. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna be fun. I haven't been to this area since our drive-in show back in September, which was awesome, it was a lot of fun. Tomorrow night we have early and late shows in Cleveland and the same thing in Columbus on Saturday. So, uh, that should be interesting. I think the next four shows are sold out. I could be wrong, but um, we're either sold out or, or we're really close. But I'm just, I'm just so like pumped that, that everybody out there is, is uh, you know, supporting like this. So thank you guys very much. Um, thanks to everybody at the Tiffin Brewery last night. The staff was awesome. They took care of us. Everybody out there in the crowd, Brandon appreciates it as well. We're just happy to be back out here doing shows. Anyway, I'm gonna get back to the green room and warm up the voice. And uh, I'm going to do this thing here in Pittsburgh tonight. Hope I'm going to see you tonight at the merch table. Come say what's up.